Hello, I am Beast Hamster 29, or Beastie for short, but many of you might know me better as Mr. Nice Guy. And today I'm going to give you a basic summary of my new upcoming game called Teamwork Obby 4. Now, what the main setting of the story is, you are on a floating island in the sky known as Crystal Falls. But because the sacred gems of life were removed from their resting place, the island is breaking apart and disappearing. A dark being known as Black Haze has stolen these gems and scattered them across the land, and you and your friends need to get them back. The four gems are based on four elements of life, earth, water, fire, and ice. Each zone is based on the gem it holds, so if the zone holds earth gem, most of the zone will have to do about earth, and if the zone holds a fire gem, it will have to do about fire. And, well, you get the idea. So yeah, big whoop. You're on an island looking for gems. Sounds like the last few of my teamwork hobbies, right? <laughs> Wrong. The courses in this game won't feel like a regular obstacle course. Heck, it won't even feel like an obstacle course at all. That's because each zone is going to be like a small adventure filled with puzzles and obstacles that are needed to be overcome to obtain your prize. But don't get me wrong, the game will definitely be an obstacle course, it just won't feel like one. No level 1, level 2, level 3s or anything like that. Just one giant course with its own puzzle. Okay, so you're just collecting gems to save an island. But the gems are just a start. After collecting the gems, you can place them back in their sacred resting place, hidden on the island somewhere. Which will open up a new path. The path to Dark Realms. The area in which Black Haze resides. Gathering a team of friends, you can enter the Dark Realms to fight Black Haze himself to rescue the true prize of the game, Princess Emerald. Speaking of teams, there will be a new system in this game that I am designing myself. It's going to be known as the Teamwork System. Typing slash create will create a group for you that you can control as the leader. Then typing invite player name here will invite the player into your group, which then that person will have to accept the invite to join your group. So what's that system good for? You can enter um, a two or four player course because if you do not have a team of the set amount of people needed you will not be able to enter the course what's even more is that you can monitor your friends health in your group if you look inside the my group box you'll notice their health and where they are another good thing is inside a teamwork course only you and your team can complete the activities together if another person from another team tries to complete a course with you, it will not work. Well, that's pretty much it for this teaser. Stay tuned in my group on Roblox.com for more updates on Teamwork Abby 4. For now, this is Mr. Nice Guy, signing off.